What's up gamers, GamerDad here. This is a guide to help you complete the Avatar Elements quest, deal damage to opponents with fire bending. If you haven't subscribed or used my creator code in your Fortnite item shop, please take both of these actions. I greatly appreciate your support. So hopefully you've followed along with my other videos because you can really get three of these challenges done all in one shebang by going to the right elemental sh shrine and getting the fire bending mythic item. Then you're gonna go do then you're going to come to a boss area because you can basically go to either of these one uh, locations on the map. Go to the one at the top though. The reason you're going to this elemental shrine is because it has fire bending, but also because it's near the underworld and grim gate. Now, this is the elemental shrine inside here. You'll see this, you search it, I use the square, whatever button is showing right beside the word search is what you'll use. You'll pick up both of the fire bending mythics. Take any shields or other weapons around here, crush that slurp barrel if you choose, and then head right away to either the underworld or grim gate. Whichever one of these you're most comfortable doing, you're going to come here and you're going to challenge the boss. And if you go to grim gate, you're going to fight a bunch of wolves and Cerberus. Or if you go to the underworld, you're going to fight minions and Hades. And the nice thing is, because this isn't deal damage to players, you can go after super easy opponents, like the wolves. These wolves are like honestly the easiest thing to kill, and they barely take any damage off you. So you'll show up here. In this case, somebody had already engaged and was fighting um, Cerberus and the wolves. So I showed up mid-battle. Not ideal. But still, as you can see, the, I got 150 damage from that wolf. I do not like the fire slam, which is L2. I like the fire sweep, which is R2. You can see the controls on the left side of the screen there. And I'm not going to get it all done here, but I know it's possible because I kind of blew it here. I'm at six, almost 600 damage, and I had never used the fire bending mythic prior to today, so I totally sucked with it. I'm not going to lie. But I did die, and now I'm just going to repeat the same thing in a second match. So if you die, you go right back to the same shrine, and then you can head over to the Underworld and or Grim Gate again, which is what I did here. So as you saw, I also killed a player in between. So any players you see, you'll take them out with the same mythic weapon. But if you get here and no one has already, you know, called upon or challenged the boss, whether it's Hades or Cerberus, you do that and then just back up a bit. Because I find that this fire bending works better from like a, sh a little bit of a distance. Up close, you could use the fire slam. But I just wanted to do what I was, you know, worked well with. So like you can see, the challenge is done. I didn't even need to fight Cerberus. Hope the guide is helpful. Please drop a like, leave me a comment. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please hit that button and shove that support. And don't forget to use my creator code in your Fortnite item shop. It is GamerDad. All one word, all capital letters. Good luck. And until the next video, this is GamerDad out.